Today, I'm gonna show you how to make a coin magically move through solid glass. Keep watching. Hey everyone, it's Caleb from Wondershare Filmora, here to empower your inner video creator. Do you wanna become a magician in your videos? Anybody can do it with the power of editing. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to do a really cool coin trick in Filmora 11. But first, let's talk about a filmmaking technique called cutting on action that I'm gonna use in today's tutorial. Cutting on action is a technique that editors use to cut in the middle of an action to another shot that matches the first shot's action. Typically, the subject starts an action in one shot and continues the action in another one, so it creates a smooth transition. When we make this coin trick video, we'll need to cut on the tapping action to help sell the illusion, and so the cut won't be as noticeable. Now, let's get the footage we need for editing. We'll need a glass and two coins for this effect. We're gonna set the phone vertically to film footage for this effect. During filming, make sure the phone is on a tripod and stays at the same point, so the frame doesn't change. First, I'll show the coin and the bottom of the glass. Then, I'm going to tap down on the coin and let the coin drop. My assistant will drop the other coin from the top, while I'm pretending to tap the coin on the glass again. Don't worry about my assistant's hand in the frame, we can remove it easily with the masking feature in Filmora. The second shot is a clean plate of the background. We'll film it for 20 seconds. Now let's bring the clips into Filmora 11. If you haven't downloaded Filmora, get started by visiting filmora.wondershare.com or clicking the link in the description. Drag and drop the clip on the first track of the timeline. Move the playhead to the right and find the spot where I tap the coin the last time before my assistant drops the other coin. Make sure it's in the middle of the tapping action. Make a cut here. Then move the playhead to the right and find the spot where my assistant drops the coin while I'm tapping without the coin in my hand. Make sure it's in the middle of the tapping action too. Make a cut here. Now I'm going to delete the middle part. Let's play it back. Cutting on action is key here to create the illusion that the action is continued without editing. Next, I'm going to remove my assistant's hand in the frame with the Filmora masking feature. I'll hide the first video track for now to see the mask clearly. Drag and drop the clean plate video onto the second track of the timeline. Double click the clip to open the setting window. Find the mask section and select the single line. Now we can see the mask is applied. Adjust the angle and position of the mask to only show the top part of the frame. Then I'm going to change the blur strength to add more blur to the edge of the mask. With the mask finalized, let's unhide the first video track and adjust the length of the clip on the timeline. Okay, let's play back and see how it looks. All right, that's how we make a coin move through solid glass by using the cutting on action editing technique. Do you wanna see more magic tricks that can be done in Filmora? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for new videos on the channel. Keep creating and I'll see you next time.